Hey everybody, it's um, Friday and it's uh, May 15th and uh, I'm leaving Newcastle on the Tyne and heading over to, uh, uh, where am I going? Darlington, yeah, which will be great. And then the next day, I have a complete day off, just a day. Uh, I'm going to be in Manchester, I believe. I'll spend the day in Manchester, have some fun, um, maybe go check out that uh, new Angels and Demon movie. That'll be kind of cool. Uh, yesterday uh, started gloriously. A big English breakfast, and uh, Scotty met me. Uh, Don had to uh, uh, do some stuff, and uh, after Scott had dropped uh, Michael off at school, uh, he took me on a little um, sightseeing adventure. We went to Loch Lomond, uh, absolutely amazing, to the Duck Inn first, then headed up to this uh, old Scottish village. Um, I have some pictures. Oh, I've got some cool pictures. Uh, I'll probably post them both on the Facebook and on the blog. Facebook, I'll probably just upload them into a little file because they're pretty cool. Um, it, it, it was a wonderful little trip out, and uh, the first time I didn't have to drive someplace and just went and looked at something, it, it was great. Uh, after that, uh, he dropped me off uh, uh, back at the hotel, and I headed on the road. Uh, it was a short drive, uh, two and a half, three hours, and uh, I made it here. Um, now, the highways have been amazing all the way. Motorways are just spectacular here in uh, the UK. Uh, but the way back, all of a sudden, I was off a motorway, and I was on the... Uh, uh, just two lanes uh, with big trucks, or as I call them, lorries in front of me, and uh, it was a was a longer time just because uh, uh, you're driving half the speed that you're allowed to speed because uh, there's uh, people in front of you with caravans, that's a trailer, and uh, trucks uh, or lorries. Um, a beautiful city. I didn't get to see a lot of Newcastle, but uh, I'm going to take a look around today. I'll post a couple pictures of the buildings around here. There's uh, the Millennium Bridge, a spectacular arch bridge that at nighttime. It was all lit up with colors. At one point, it was purple. It's very nice. And uh, some giant concert hall, I think. I don't know. But it's a giant neared building. Uh, my lecture was well attended. It was a good crowd of people, uh, uh, fun people, and uh, uh, basically a good time uh, all the way around. Uh, Sarah and Graham uh, uh, made sure that they had a really cool uh, uh, meeting facility where they had a projection screen already waiting for me. And... Uh, uh, it was a really good time. A uh, couple of uh, guys invited me to drop by the magic shop. Uh, Going to go say hi to Chris today uh, before I leave. And uh, this guy, uh, Matthew J. Dowden, uh, he's, uh, he and I had a little conversation about working on cruise ships and uh, looks very competent. Uh, seemed uh, uh, very strong and uh, uh, ready and willing to get out there. I think he'll do really well and, uh, and succeed at uh, any of the goals he's after. Uh, hey, be careful what you wish for. You just might get it. Um, Basically, uh, all in all, a great day. Uh, the hotel, uh, this is not the finest travel lodge I've stayed in. Uh, in fact, there's uh, holes punched in the walls and on the floor. Hey, wait, you want to see? Check this out. Maybe I can tilt this so you can see. Uh, can you see the nice big hole in the wall? Check that out. Yes. Um, it, it, there's a lot of young people staying at this hotel, in the, at least last night. And at about 1.30, 2 o'clock in the morning, uh, uh, might even been a little bit later, like 3. Uh, there was fighting outside my hallway, and not one person, there were about 14 guys. Uh, I kind of peeked through the peek hole because I wasn't opening the door, because uh, they were bashing one guy's head uh, against my door. It was it was delightful. Um, oh, but I did get a good night's sleep. It's the first night that I've actually slept until like 9 o'clock in the morning. Um, something changed. I just, uh, I got a good night's sleep. It was great. Um, I spoke to Hannah last night, too, and uh, she told me that uh, uh, she got uh, 6 out of 10 and 3 out of 3 in her spelling. Uh, the bonus words are the hard ones. 3 out of 3 is really good. So uh, I know Hannah watches this. Congratulations, Hannah. You did an awesome job. Um, that's basically it for the day. Nothing else really exciting. Uh, just going to get in the car and drive. Uh, I'll arrive uh, early into Darlington. Uh, the next day is a complete day off Manchester. The next day I do my lecture in Manchester. And then uh, heading towards Leicester, Coventry. In uh, Coventry, I'm going to see an old friend. That'll be very fun. I'm looking forward to it. I'll tell you more about it uh, closer to it, or else I won't have anything to talk about then. Uh, you guys keep busy, keep happy. Most of all, uh, keep watching the blog. Yeah, that's it. Bye for now.